Hi, this is Sarah Meinzel with The Poultry Site, and today we're here with Ken Long. He is the Director of North American Sales with James Way. Thanks for being with us today, Ken. Thank you, Sarah. It's great to be with you. Very good. Tell me a little bit about what you're highlighting here at the IPPE this year. Okay, well, there are many advantages to our machine compared to our competitors. Um, one that I'd like to share today is the energy efficiency of our fans compared to our competitors. Okay. Um, our ECUs, or environmental control units, are um, contain four fans, four motors, and they are variable speed. Um, they run at whatever the machine and the eggs dictate it needs for the controlled environment. Um, they are all uh, synchronized. Right. Uh, should one go out, the others would pick up and uh, replace what's displaced with the one that's, that's not operating. Um, so therefore, it d definitely right. provides some redundancy. Unlike our competitors who have one motor, one large motor, one large paddle fan um, that obviously does not have right. any redundancy. So the energy efficiency uh, of our machines um, is, is very uh, unique in that uh, it provides um, much ener energy savings. Um, our next closest competitor uh, requires 20% uh, annualized uh, electric use just to operate the <clears throat> fans to supply the air in the machine. Um, the next closest competitor uh, is over double our energy uh, consumption and then the last two uh, are four times. Uh, so it's very substantial uh, in, in an annual uh, year on a average size hatchery, two million um, egg set, uh, would, would be anywhere from $5,000 on the lower end okay. on a year that up to $100,000 variance. Wow. So it's very substantial. Yeah, that's substantial. And you were saying before that, that the fan system really talks to the unit, right? Yes, ma'am. We have profiles or programs <clears throat> that dictate what um, Need, is needed for the environment. The right. egg age uh, obviously determines, and, and egg age and the temperature determines how much fans uh, or speed should be applied to the environment. Very good. So tell me a little bit about, you know, kind of what's in it for the, the producer. Um, I know we talked about, you know, how it how it can impact the eggs, but how, what is the, what is the producer uh, gain from this? Well, two things. Number one, because we have four fans, uh, two of them run counterclockwise and two of them run clockwise, okay. it provides much better airflow throughout the entire cabinet. And then secondly, as I said, the energy savings, which is, is phenomenal. Very good. It seems like it would be a bit of peace of mind too, right? Because if one goes out, the other ones are going to pick Absolutely. up the, the slack, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Absolutely. And invariably, it's going to happen at 2 a.m. Right. That, and obviously, our alarm will let, allow right. you to know that, but uh, it does not uh, worry the, the hatchery manager to know he's got to have someone come in, re replace that motor. He right. can do it when it's convenient to him at the next day or so. Right. Exactly. Very good. Well, thank you so much for all the information. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Appreciate it. This is Sarah Michael with the Poultry Site.